Hello. Hello, Michael. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. How are you? Hot. Very hot. It's very okay. hot. Right. Very hot outside. Very hot. Sometimes I wish I wish I could bring my central air from Canada to Ukraine. It would, it would help a lot. <laughs> so today's topic is about annoying things that people do. Okay, so a lot of the times that uh, we always have something that annoys us. It seems like uh, in Ukraine, people uh, they just ignore it. A lot of things don't don't bother people here. They they let it they let it pass. We could say we let it pass. Victoria, hi, how are you? Hello, I'm fine. Thank you. Good. Do you know what the and topic you? is today? I'm okay. Oh, I like this. Yes, I know. It's about it's about annoying things that people do. Annoying thing. Who else is here as well? Who is this? Who is this? Al. Alina. Alina. My name is Alina. Yes. I, and I your name that. is. Uh huh. Yeah, you can see me. Can you see me? I, I can see you. I just uh, it's it's. I just took me a little while to recognize and see your name there in in Sterling. Yes. Yeah, so uh, yeah my name is very difficult name. to pronounce. Yes. And your name is Michael. Yes, if I'm not mistaken. Mikhailo, yeah. Michael. They say Mishka. I don't know why. The others are call me Mishka. Uh, so, Elena, where are you from? I'm from Ukraine. And what about you? I'm in Ukraine too. Really? Are you yeah. from Ukraine? Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Well, background is uh, from from uh, Ukraine, so but uh, I, I don't speak Ukrainian well. Uh, where, where are you? Where are you in Ukraine? You don't mind me asking. Uh, well, 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 what can you repeat, please? I cannot hear you well, and I cannot see you at all, really. Where, uh, where are you in Ukraine? Ah, where I am in Ukraine. I am in now. I am in Zhitomir, but I live in Hako. Yes, I went to visit my parents. Uh, they live uh, not far away. Um, they live maybe in Zhitomir. Yes, in Zhitomir region. Zhitomir region. I'm here. Yes. Yeah, region. Yes, we say. It. Okay. Yes, I, 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 and, I, 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 um, sorry. Uh huh. Yes, okay. speak, speak. I'm sorry. Sorry for interrupting you. I'm sorry. No, no, no. You continue. Wait, hold on, just a second. Tanya, hello, are you there? Hi, how are you? Uh, Tanya, have you been in my class before? Hello, Tanya? Tanya? Maybe not. Hi, All right. hi. Hi, can you hear me? I can hear you, can you hear me? Yes, yes, I just... T Tanya, where are you from? I'm from Kherson, it's... Southern city. I, I know where that is. I have some students from there as well. All right, to to begin. So, uh, who else did I miss? Anyone else? I don't think I missed as well. No. So, uh, the taste today's topic is about uh, annoying things that that people do. So, there's always uh, something uh, annoying. Uh, in, in English, we call it uh, a pet peeve. Uh, sometimes. So, if you don't know what a pet peeve is, this is what we use in our in our Western talk, so don't don't. I wouldn't copy it because it would sound kind of funny from someone in Eastern Europe, but it's good to understand. It's called a pet peeve. All right, so that's, that's another American slang. Yeah, Michael, sorry. Is it American slang? Yeah, it's, it's an American expression. You know, it's only used yeah, yeah. by Americans. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So we someone, all know it. Someone in Britain isn't going to use it. So uh, the, the first list here, I have. Uh, when uh, drivers don't use a turn signal. Now in Eastern mm -hmm. Europe, you know, people, oh, they drive a little bit like need for speed. So, uh, I, I don't know, for, for me, it, it bothers me when uh, when people, they don't use their turn signal. They just go, they, they cut in the lane. Does this bother anybody else? Who, who, who drives here? Who drives in Ukraine? Anybody? No, 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 unfortunately, I don't drive. It's for me. I don't have a license even. I don't understand it. Yes, how to drive even. And uh, but what what me, what bothers you with with drivers in general? Can you tell me? Like my the drivers. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. uh, can I say? Yep. Can I tell you? Uh, for me, for example, maybe uh, I 
uh, drivers maybe irritate me or bothers me when bother me sorry or irritate me when they drink a lot of alcohol yeah and uh, when they uh, drive uh, not attentively and uh, when they don't um, uh, when they don't what um, when they uh, don't allow people yet to go um, to go on the road, I think. Maybe cross the street, cross the yeah, road. Yeah, maybe cross the street. Yeah, maybe sometimes. But it's, uh, I don't like when uh, the drivers when they drink. Yes, because I saw uh, many times, um, uh, especially uh, in the public uh, transport, when the drivers they were a little bit <laughs> drunk. I <laughs> drunk, and I think, I suppose. Are, are these marshutka bus drivers or just normal drivers? <laughs> Maybe, uh, yeah, marshutka, trolley bus, and uh, I saw even in the taxi, yes, one time. Oh, uh, yes, someone I was taxi. Talked, mm -hmm. Yes, even taxi driver, yes. <laughs> it is very popular in Ukraine, very popular. <laughs> yes. Very much. Well, you know, sometimes uh, when you drivers go so fast, that... Sometimes that marshutka bus driver, he's in a hurry for some reason. He needs to make a stop, and he goes so fast that the wind, the wind yeah. takes me away. And I, you know, the, it's really close to getting into a car accident. V Vitaly, are, are you there? Hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, everybody. Hi. So, t Vitaly, it's yeah. about uh, annoying things people do. I, I said, you know, when drivers, when they drive crazy, it bothers me. This is not Need for Speed, the video game. What, what <laughs> bothers you when it comes to drivers in general? Uh, yeah. Uh, it it bothers me. It's um, annoying when drivers in road bus in uh, Mashrutka, as you know, <laughs> when they're not um, very polite, when they're not suave with passengers. Respectful, okay, sure. Um, and I see it, um, this kind of situation very often in our town. So it I hate this situation. I it irritates, really irritates me, because uh, drivers have to be helpful for people, because they getting money from them and they are not uh, polite. It's it's irritating. But uh, you know what? I, I got used to this. I think I just got used to it being here. I don't mind it at all. No, I, I I like it. It's it's awesome now. Like you that. like it? No, well, it's strange. I like Very it. strange. <laughs> It's strange, you know. It's really when when people used to pass me. Uh oh. What is this? What is it? Is you it your you never know. You never know what happens here. You never know. <laughs> uh, but let's uh, let's continue like that. People who read out loud uh, what they are typing in an email or letter. Letter, you know, like, hello, my name is Mike. I'm just replying to your email. I, I don't know. Does this bother anyone? Like uh, when they when they're typing and, and reading at the same time, or they're typing and saying something at the same time. Does anyone have this annoyance? Mm, no. Mm -hmm. you, do you understand what I mean? Can you hear me? I can hear you. Ah, oh. uh, you can hear me. I can hear you. So does everyone understand? Uh, There's a little yeah. bit of a lag, so mm. Mm -hmm. uh, so this annoyance is when you're 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 reading and out loud, basically. Does everyone understand this? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, I understand this from. And this does this bother anybody? No. Yes, for sure. Yeah. But I don't yeah. often hear that. <laughs> uh -huh. And. As for me, I want to tell that I have never seen such people, yes, who read aloud, really, uh, especially in public places, uh, in public transport. As for me, I have never met such people. I'm lucky, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I in haven't. Ukraine, I mean. I haven't either. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but... Uh, <laughs> and... Uh, People who drink directly out of milk container. You know, people usually people use a glass. Some people are are are, are, are uh, they're, they're they're getting American habits because American. You see this like on American TV series. It bothers me. I I don't like when other people when they drink out of a a, a container or a carton. I'll start with Tanya. Tanya, does this bother you? Mm. <laughs> Not really, maybe. 
We are such people. <laughs> yeah. In in Ukraine, is, is, do, you, do you see this? Is this is this a culture thing, or is it? No, no, no. People get I mean, the glass. If it's your family, you can share. Sometimes you just pay attention, maybe. Victoria, what do you think? Uh, oh. <laughs> I'd like to say uh, about drivers because uh, it was previous. Yeah. Um, so I live in Thailand, and here. Um, Drivers are very crazy. They are fast, and I don't like that. But Victoria, where were you originally from? I'm from Russia. But don't they drive faster too? I mean, are you not used to like uh, in China, Thailand, all this lot of these countries? They the driving's crazy. You know, it's it's some sort of professional stunt driver or something. So. Are you surprised, or is it is it worse than in Russia? Oh, I don't like that. In Russia, also, I don't like when people say swear words. For example, say like rude words. Um, I don't like uh, to go by underground. I prefer going by motorbike. So for me, it's the best it's the best way. But um, I think. Um, a lot of things in this world annoys me. Annoy me. All right. <laughs> when when you say underground, what what are you talking about? Like the the uh, in in Thailand there, or I don't know if they have an underground. Or are we talking like in Moscow subway station? Mm -hmm. So yes, here 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 is normal, but I mean uh, in Moscow and St. Petersburg, no, I don't like that. But yeah, it's very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good. And, and what about people drinking out of the carton container from the fridge? I, I think these people are dirty. What do you think? <laughs> I don't understand. From container what? Container, carton. Carton, carton. How do you say carton in Russian? Karopka, pachka malaka. Ah, is malaka. Right. Oh, cold cool. juice, anything, anything yeah, that's a container. Yeah. People drink to them and go, go, like... Like American oh. people do, yes. Like American <laughs> people, absolutely. Well, someone got it there, good. I think, I think it's, 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 it's full of bacteria, and I, I think it's just... Yeah, I don't, yeah. I, I, it mm -hmm. bothers me. Does it bother you? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's what I want to hear. And, uh, uh, Alina, what about Alina, you? Alina, yeah. Uh, you know, uh, as for me, I have never done it because I drink uh, milk and juices from my glasses. Yes, but from from a glass, from my glass. But uh, yes, I know that some people prefer to drink uh, milk. Yes, uh, from the cartoon um, carton package. Carton. Yeah, package. Carton. Carton. Car carton. Sorry, carton, carton packages. Yes, because it's very convenient for them, and maybe it's not a, a beautiful thing to do, but I think it's convenient for people, I don't know, it doesn't bother me at all, as for me, yeah, it's my opinion. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, uh, just looking at the list here, uh, people who are mean to animals, people who what? are meat animals? mean, let me write it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, animals. What do you say? Are people mean to animals, or do you think people can are, are cruel? Does it, I mean, like, you know, I, I don't think people should be cruel to animals because the animals yeah. they don't know any better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Michael. Animals are our brothers and sisters. <laughs> Joke, yes. We should respect they're, them. They're they're one of us. Yes. Victoria, yes. Yes, I'm vegetarian. I don't eat animals. And I <laughs> you don't eat any animal. No, you're I'm a vegetarian. I eat uh, fish, uh, meat, and eggs, but I drink milk from the packages. 
Okay, wait, wait. So just to, to recap, you don't eat any eggs, uh, fish, poultry, meat, but uh, you drink like from milk per se. Correct? Is that is that correct? Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay. Well, a, a lot of vegetarians. Hello, Luba. Well, a lot of a lot of vegetarians out there these days. But you know, like I, I don't know. I think you know if you eat a cow, you're you're not being cruel. It, it's just it's in you to survive. You know, people. Mm -hmm. People need to eat meat. That's my opinion. So, like, you, there's two ways to look at it. You know, like, uh, you know where Kentucky, you know Kentucky Fried Chicken, right? I mean, they're they're out there in uh, Ukraine now and and Russia. They're pretty not nice to their animals because, uh, you know, it's like a big farm of chickens. So I think that's a little bit different. It's just like a mass production line. That's cruel. A little bit different. So Luba, Luba, today's topic is about was knowing things people do. Or what they say. What 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 bothers you? What annoys you? Can you tell us? Mm -hmm. Oh, Luba, I don't hear you. Luba. Mm hmm. What about people snoring? When people uh, snore on on the train, on the plane, for example. Do you hear this? Yeah. Yeah, very often. <laughs> really? Uh, yeah, only time was Bob. One, this one babushka on the train. I, I, it was very loud though. I had to wake her no, up. No, no, great old lady. No, it's young man. They snore. Yeah, they snoring all the time. When I go uh, by the train somewhere or by the plane, yes, uh, they snore very often. Young men and young girls especially. Yes, it bothers. It kills me. It is killing me softly, and I hate it. Yes. What, what about why are they snoring? They didn't get enough sleep. I don't understand. I I, I never snoring just... like like this. Yeah, they are doing like this when they are going somewhere. So kill yeah. them all. <laughs> <laughs> bang bang. It's a very bad habit. Anyone else? Tanya, her son. Have you seen this? People snoring on the train or on the bus. I think it's not their fault. They have some problem with their health. Maybe some. Oh. Um, it's actually bad for your organism when you're snoring, so they need to do something with that. Because it means like the brain doesn't get enough oxygen and they snore. For example, I don't know. Well, if I can't sleep, I'm being bothered. Doesn't matter to me. That's it. I, I'm gonna close their nose on them. Well, my cat snores. <laughs> no, I. My either, yeah, my like so snoring, but when people do it, yes, it sounds very, very awful. Yes, it sounds awful. And we cannot sleep <laughs> at night with them when somebody snores. Yes, it's I think it's, it's very awful. Yes, because some men do it very loudly. Yes, and you cannot uh, sleep at all. Yes. Well, if it's enough to wake up the dead, then you got a big problem there. That's for sure. <laughs> Luba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Can you see uh, me now? Wait, I hear you. Uh, yes. So, mm -hmm. what what bothers you? Uh, uh, people who snore is this a a problem? You ever hear on like in the Marshutka bus people snoring? Or is this happening? No, 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 no. The Marshutka on the oh. train on the plane. <laughs> uh, I think it's not a problem. For for me, it's not a problem when I'm not sleeping. So. Maybe maybe uh, you have your headphones on, so uh, it's hard to know if anyone is snoring. <laughs> That's one way to to block out people like that, you know. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, oh, people who read the paper while driving. Yeah, like that. Okay, sure. Uh, one second. I'm trying to get something very interesting. Uh, Conspiracy. Could someone share something? What what bother? Lubo, tell tell us what what bothers you. There has to be something that bothers you, no? Dogs bark. Bothers. It's nice. This one is annoying. Yes. Bothers. Mm -hmm. uh, makes me angry. Yes. Ah, okay. Um, I don't like when people uh sh throw, for example, rubbish. Uh, on the street. Garbage. Garbage. Rubbish, rubbish. Rubbish to English for me. Old, very old rubbish. Do you have any rubbish today? I No, no, I, I don't have rubbish, but I have garbage. Thank you. Um, so, 
Uh, uh, I like I like gar you can use rubbish, but I, I you know I, I I like to I like to laugh though when I hear this word. I never hear this word. <laughs> rubbish. <laughs> rubbish. You have any rubbish today? Okay, but continue. So people who uh, throw rubbish around, yes? Mm -hmm. Or oh, maybe when they um oh, I don't know how is it in English? Privat, privat, spill. Spill. Yes. When boys. After smoking, they spill it on the ground. Oh, they throw their cigarette on the ground. Okay. So, sorry? They, they throw their cigarette on the ground. And not only the cigarette, they... Uh, spit. 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 Spit on the ground. Spit. Yeah, spit. You know, the older people used to do it. Now I'm saying younger people take this bad habit. Spitting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tanya, does this bother you when people spit on the ground? No. I see only boys. They do it, <laughs> especially after smoking. I don't know what, what's the reason of it. But it looks really terrible. Yes, very terrible. Maybe only their people. mother didn't teach them any manners? No. Maybe, maybe. I, I, I don't know. I th isn't it illegal to spit on the ground? Well, I know that it's not uh, um, maybe in the special places it's it's forbidden, but just on the street they do it. Yeah. I you know I you know what I see like people uh, they throw their cigarette butt from their apartment flat all the mm -hmm. way down to the ground. That's. <laughs> Oh, yeah. That really bothers me. People who don't wash their hands after using their ba uh, the washroom. Mm -hmm. it, is, it is very disgusting. Victoria. <laughs> yes. What do you think about this? People who don't wash their hands after using their wa the washroom. Oh, it's disgusting. Very dirty. Very dirty. <laughs> Alina, what do you think? I like um, I, I, one other people. Um, also, I think about previous. Uh, I want to tell about. Uh, Luba told about. Uh, she didn't like people when they speed on the on the ground. I think uh, we have one decision. Um, our so if if we have time, for example. Uh, people will not do that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> For example, uh, in some countries, uh, if people will uh, speed, as they will pay around five thousand dollars, and they don't do that. And for example, in our countries, we will uh, have a temple. I think people will care. Uh, they not do that. Well, you know, you, you, I saw in, in Canada, like, the older Ukrainians would do it, right? And, uh, for, like, it was, like, a bad habit from before, but it looks like these bad habits come back to the newer generation. Well, I don't know why. I, I don't, I don't, I try to, try to forget about these type of people. Because, okay. you know, it's just a little problem. Well, what about people who don't wash their hands after they're washing? What's wrong with people? You know, like, now they got things that wash your hands for you. How lazy can people get? I think people who don't wash their hands, they are very lazy and they are not well brought up. Yes, and they are not well educated, I don't know. And they can get uh, different di diseases, yes, and it's very dangerous and it is very stupid when people uh, don't want to do it, it's my opinion. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know. I, I guess... I guess that's how people are, are brought up, per se. Uh, another one, guys who leave the toilet seat up. <laughs> I don't see the problem here. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't bother. All right, no, don't think it bothers anyone here. Dirty keyboards. Oh, come on, we all use our own... Uh, 
laptop per se nowadays. It's not like back in the day where we had to share a computer with five people. You know, it's not like one computer per village. You know. <laughs> so I I don't know. Does does anyone do, do they clean their keyboard regularly so you know it doesn't get all dirty and like that? Because I'll admit the keyboard gets really dirty sometimes. Just because my cat walks over it too. So does this bother anyone when they have a, a dirty keyboard? This was on the list. Uh -huh. Um, maybe. <laughs> you guys, don't clean your keyboards. I sometimes clean my keyboards uh, at my job because oh. uh, it's <laughs> not on the computer I mm, use on, at my work. Place. It's not only my computer. So ah. when I came after a long trip, a business trip, and I see that somebody was at my working place, my uh, sometimes yeah, yeah. at my desk, sometimes I need to clean my keyboard and it irritates me, it bothers me. I think if it's your dirt, People are okay with it, but if it's someone else's dirt, that's no okay. <laughs> Time to get the Mr. Proper out. Yes. Who said yes? I told you. Yeah. <laughs> ah, yes, yes. 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 So, I, I don't know. Like in, in Canada, like my boss would always have a hand sanitizer near his desk. Always. <laughs> Anyone else believe in hand sanitizers? Like you know, near near their table, and they're always always using some sort of hand sanitizer because he, you know, I think he was scared of germs. Hand sanitizer? <laughs> What's, what does this word mean? It sanitizes your hands. <laughs> How to say sanitizer? Uh, for, just uh, for cleaning your hands from bacteria? Yeah, for uh, bacteria. Okay, I get it. Not, not popular here, not popular. <laughs> what what I didn't I didn't hear anybody who who said what I said like in Ukraine we have this hand sanitizers but as I know in United States you can have it in college even like you can use it in well, like I saw one like um, in college restroom you know in United States and it was like really surprised for me like you can wash your hands and then use hand sanitizer after that. Very convenient, I think. Well, I think if your hands are too clean, that's another problem, too. What do you think? If your hands are too clean. Mm. Um, maybe, like, um, if you, if you like, kill um, all the necessary bacteria on your hands, it's also a problem, as I know. I mean, mm -hmm. not to be some people, some people like to be squeaky clean. We can say squeaky, squeaky clean. Okay. Car alarms that signal. What's the yeah? Car alarms that signal that they are on by honking. Car alarm alarms that signal that they are by honking. No, you know what? What happens? You know, what I hate is when people, when their car alarm goes off, and nobody goes outside to see if there's their car and it mur mur it's constantly honking it, it, it bothers me three o'clock in the morning you know it, it uh, the car alarm goes off does that bother anybody else or that they, they can sleep through it <laughs> it bothers everybody I think so too dogs barking at nighttime for no <laughs> reason yes <It's> <laughs> Uh, dirty. Here's another one. Dirty dishes in the sink. Oh, for sure. <laughs> Uba, what do you think? If there, if there's a dirty dish in the sink, do you have to go clean it, or can you let it sit? Uh, I cannot uh, stand uh, a dirty dish and unmade bed. Unmade, maybe. Yes, bed. What? 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 I make what? Um, I. So when I get up, I um. Immediately make my bed, uh -huh. in, in bring it in order, and uh, I ever I always wash dish after eating. I cannot stand it, dirty dish. 
I noticed this with Eastern European, uh, actually women in particular, that everything, yes. it, it, the dishes have to be squeaky clean. Uh, you know, they, they get their, what do I have here, their, uh, their, their fairy out or whatever they're using. It has to be always, why? Well, why can't you have a, di why does it bother you? I don't understand. It's a mess. It's, it's a mess. tradition. <laughs> it's a tradition? <laughs> No, I mean, I think it's easier to clean your dishes when they are still, like, like not fresh, how to say, like, it's, it's easy, like, you just can wash it with water and it will be easily cleaned, you know, so when it's, like, a, a week in your sink and it's hard to remove all dirty on, from mm -hmm. that place, you know, it's, yeah. <laughs> but in America, they use dishwashers, you know. Oh, cheaters. <laughs> How lazy can you get to use a dishwasher? Those dishwashers don't even clean properly. Yeah. I know a lot, of, a lot of Ukrainian women, when they visit America, when they see this dishwasher, they don't use it. They go back to the sink. They don't like dishwashers. <laughs> Maybe because, uh, for example, if I have only one cup and one um, bowl, I, I don't use wash dish, dishes. I can do it um, near the sink. For what I, I will switch on my wash dishes if I, I can do it on my, my own. Just one cup and or one bowl. Mm -hmm. Tanya, what do you think? I I agree. Agree. Sorry, I no, 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 Tanya, sorry, Victoria, sorry, I just, you know. <laughs> oh, I like these watches. Um, my parents had, but now I live with my parents. So I have to wash uh, dishes by my hands, and I don't like that. <laughs> so sometimes, uh, sometimes I don't. For example, okay, uh, one day. <laughs> so, Michael, do you understand me or not? So no. I don't know how to explain it. So I mean now uh, that sometimes I don't just I put I put dishes into the sink yeah. and it can it can be there around um, one day for example if I'm busy and then I I try to wash but it annoys me. Uh, for, for me, I, I I wait for my wife to do it. You know, I'm a very lazy person. <laughs> I, I can't I, I can't do it. I can do it, of course, but. Uh, you know, if I was coming to someone else's place, you know, I would, well, what dirty people, you know? But for me, it's okay. <laughs> I'm an exception. <laughs> anything else no, that I'm, annoys, sorry, anything I'm else that annoys people? Because my mouse is freezing up on me. Vitaly, anything that really, really annoys you? Anything uh, else? When somebody uh, take my okay. things, my stuff, without me, without my permission. It annoys me. People for do sure. that? I, I thought people they ask for permission usually. Mm. Hi, can I please borrow something? Sometimes my tools, my at, at my job, they use my tools and it um, irritates me. Without permission, it's quite um, bothering situation. <laughs> It's quite bothersome, we can say. Bother. It's, mm -hmm. it's really bothering me. Oh, my desk. Michael, may yeah. I ask a question? Um, Go ahead. Yes, and if, if somebody is... If some, I, also, I also don't like if somebody takes my uh, tools or something like that, but... But what do you do usually if people take your stuff? They take your uh, stuff? Hide it. Hide your stuff. Put it in a, in a safe. That's what I do. That's where I put my knife and fork. <laughs> Skinny jeans on men. Oh. Miguel. Skinny jeans on men. I think these guys, uh, I think it's hard for them to walk. 
<laughs> Luba, what do you think? Mm. So if it's convenient, if it uh, if they are convenient for 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 boys, why not? I don't. Um, so it it doesn't annoy me. And uh, <coughs> if if, uh, if boy has a beautiful, not beautiful, I don't know, uh, legs. Why not? <laughs> it looks so it awful, looks, usually. It, it, it looks, looks awful. But not like skinny jeans like a woman. I, I, like how can a guy wear jeans like that? I've seen some guys, their jeans are so tight that I, I'm surprised there's blood going to their legs. <laughs> <laughs> not only to legs. <laughs> Tanya, do, do you see this? I, I see, I, in Canada, I saw it all the time. I don't think these guys could have kids in the future. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I don't know, I think, I mean, in my city it's not quite popular because probably you can be... Beat up? Yeah, beat up. <laughs> <laughs> like, gay. Oh, <laughs> my person is not a gay, but... I, I just don't, I don't understand. I mean, on women it's it's different, for me, you gotta put it there, but for, for a guy I just, unless you're trying to... <laughs> Um, maybe it, it looks maybe maybe it looks more awful when um, a fat woman, really fat woman, wears something very, uh, very, very yes. Tight. Was it tie or how how was it this word? Contingency, the capability bulletin. Tie, uski da, very. Slim, very slim, yes. Very slim. So, and, and, and we can see all underwear that she wears. It, it's re really awful. Very awful. Oh, yeah. When, so, underwear all. I don't know. <laughs> we, can, we can see everything. It's really terrible. Very. Or even. If, if body is beautiful, then why not? Everybody could wear what, what he or she wants. Because it, it's a fashion, it's a fashion. But uh, a person must um, compare um, his or her outlook with with wears, <laughs> so to say, with clothes. <laughs> or or, or mm -hmm. some shirts that you can see through, and I, <laughs> I don't like what I see sometimes. <laughs> I get nightmares. Yeah. yeah. Vitaly, no. What? Does this bother Does this bother you when you can see through, uh, you know, the Persian shirt and it just, you know, sometimes I don't know. Easy. What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> it's your rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> if it's my rabbit, then we have a problem, you know. <laughs> Sorry about that. So what I'm saying is when you can see through their shirt, you know, I, I don't know. For me, like I said, I get nightmares. Vitaly, does this, does this bother you? Try not to look at it. Look look straight ahead. Don't pay attention. Uh, you mean women or men with <laughs> slim, slim jeans? I haven't seen a man yet, but continue. <laughs> 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 a man with a bra on, okay, well, you know. Oh. I don't quite understand. Uh, you mean, repeat, please. Yeah. Th those shirts that you can see through them, you know, like some, It's I don't know, like you can see a bra or something, you can see like, it's like they have no shirt on almost, it's like transparent or almost, it's like some sort uh, of, you know. Yes, I get it. Uh, but it's when it uh, when mm, we talk about a woman when she has a beautiful body, why not? Oh, okay, there's, there's always exceptions. There's always exceptions, of exceptions, course. Exceptions, yes, of course, for sure. Uh, people who pick their nose in public. People who pick their nose. Mm -hmm. Do we understand what this means? Mm -hmm. They use their finger to pick their mm -hmm. nose. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Miguel, how often do you see this? Do you see this often? Uh, what about uh, what about you? Picking their nose with their finger. 
Let's bother you. Can you show us? <laughs> Later. Yeah, we can understand that. <laughs> <laughs> I, I okay, may, maybe <laughs> it, it, it's just a, a like allergy, something like that. And maybe it, 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 it's dangerous for for such a people because they could they could break their fingers <laughs> doing this. What kind of nose do they have? I wonder. Uh, so, so so to say, no, so to say. For example, when uh, children do. This parents uh, say to them, don't do it. You can break your fingers. It's just a bad manner. I think it it happens now. Not now. Days not so often when adult people do it. This maybe children can do it. Yes. Uh, just uh, trying to figure out like if if you have an itchy nose, what what do you do? What do you do? Yeah, I need I need my nose scratched. You know, people with allergies, right? You know, it's it's August. It's ragweed, right? Uh, people who are late. People who are late. I find here in Eastern Europe, if you're late, if you're late, you're a dead person. You know, people they're not so forgiving. Sometimes that marshutka bus gets stuck somewhere, and I have to wait. So you know, that's my excuse every time. The bother. Tanya, does that bother when people they, they come up late? Are you are you understandable to understand that maybe something happened or you're not so forgiving? You're asking me? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, actually, I'm such a person uh, that I like to, to be late. I don't know why. It's just a habit. It's just, uh, I don't know. It's a habit, really. I know I can wake up earlier, like... Before meeting, like special for that, but I will, I will be late anyways. It just, I just can't change myself. I'm like, I was late in university, and so you think you'll be on time, right? Is that that's what it is? I mean, Anyone me. else? Is this a bother? Is, is who who here has to be punctual? Uh, I have a question to Tanya. Is it really you do it especially too late? It's not because no, uh, it's like, I don't know. I don't know why, but I like. Oh, I have like more. I have five minutes to do something more, like uh, to stand in front of the mirror, for example, for five minutes longer, like. And you just five? It's not five. I think it's twenty-five, thirty-five. I mean, it depends. Sometimes Marshutka is like <laughs> lonely, like when you like have morning exam and just it's just Marshutka, you know. It's not my fault. <laughs> Blame it on Marshutka. <laughs> yeah. I, sometimes I'm late for two hours. I say I'm just a stupid foreigner. Works every time. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you late? What is wrong with you? We are punctual. I say, I'm stupid. I got lost. I'm new here. Oh, it's okay. You should have told me before. <laughs> <laughs> Works every time. Uh, what else do we have here? Vitaly, second. What, what, what bothers you? I haven't talked to you too much. What really bothers you, annoys you with what people do? Is there anything in particular? Oh, uh, second one. Oh, second one. Okay. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> number two. <laughs> uh, so please repeat because I. Uh, what what bothers you? What makes you angry? What people do? Oh, mm -hmm. so it's really about late uh, because my girlfriend every time late. I don't understand why she did it, and she uh, and when we uh, was uh, we we were at the seaside. So I know the truth. Uh, it's begin uh, from uh, from the bath and. Uh, uh, when we we have five minutes to go, everybody is waiting for us, and she she go to uh, to to make your if, makeup makeup makeup, 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 all yes, on, makeup. Out of the nose oh yeah, yeah yes and then uh, with something with her uh, with uh, something wrong with um, with hair 
Uh, she, she, she take and she do it, do it, do it every time. No, it's not okay. Oh no, it's not okay. How I, how oh, is it okay? Oh, it's okay. Go. No, it's not okay. And it's, it's 35, 40 minutes. It's, 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 it's. Uh, I can, I can, can see it every time. It's, it's, uh, yeah, you know, with my wife, same thing. And you know what she says? I'm a woman. That's okay. Yes, That's yes. Fine. <laughs> it's what? okay. Yes, yes. We, every everybody do it. Uh, everybody does it. I, I said, what movie are you going to be in to look so perfect? <laughs> Forty minutes, my God. Forty minutes. This is not picture day. Not every day is going to be picture day. But you know, yeah, you know, I I can see people. They they like to powder their nose a little bit too long there per se. Uh, pants on men that are too short. <laughs> what too short? Sorry. Pants on men that are too short. Oh. Luba, do you Luba's understand? Very this? strange. Oh. Luba, can you understand this? Can you comprehend this? Somebody yeah. translate for her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> pants. Ah, pants. Okay, yes, it's clear now. <laughs> I think if we saw that, like like what uh, Tanya said, they would. I, I think they would be beat up too. So I don't, I don't see that here in Kiev. I would think it's disturbing. I don't want to see. My eyes don't want to see that. That's my eyes. Uh, when people tickle people, no, when you get tickled. I hate when people try to tickle me. They used to do it when I was a kid. Luba, do you tickle. know what it means to tickle? Tickle, like to touch? Tickle, oh. tickle, kitschy, kitschy, coo. Ah. Huh? Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. People used to tickle you when you were a kid. No? It always happens when you're a child, usually, or when even when you're an adult, people like to tickle other people. I hate it. It bothers me. Does this bother anybody else? Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah. Who still gets tickled? As for me, I, I don't like even if just touch somebody touch me. I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, so some people, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with people. <laughs> uh, what else here? Speed bumps, movie talkers, something interesting here. Uh, people who finish your sentence for you. Mm. Mm. Does this bother anybody? Some sometimes I, I I have this where I interrupt people and and I uh, I complete their sentence, but that's because I have to sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> because you're a teacher. Yeah, that's, that's my job. Yeah. I'm doing you a favor. That's what I say. <laughs> uh, an unmade bed. Luba, you said you always make your bed. Mm -hmm. So if it's not if it's not made, does this bother you? Yes, yes. Uh, maybe uh, it bothers my husband. Um, he says that I'm a crazy of cleanliness. Cleanliness. Uh, cleanliness. Yes, of making everything tidy. So maybe I'm a little bit crazy of it, but I like to to you know, yes. That um, everybody, uh, everything is clean. Everything is clean. Squeaky Mr. I, Muscle I, clean. I try to do yes, everything <laughs> to clean, and it bore, uh, it annoys. Sometimes it annoys my husband. No, it, it, sometimes <laughs> it bothers me too. My wife, she says, uh, before you can leave the ha uh, the flat, it has to be squeaky clean. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't understand these people. I, I don't <laughs> understand as well. I don't know. What about Victoria? Are, are you like this too? Everything has to be clean before you leave the flat. Victoria. In, in here. So are you uh, like this too? You know, people with unmade beds, they, 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 have to, they have to make their bed or, you know, they have to clean their flat before they leave. Like I said, with my wife, she says uh, it, she, she can't leave the flat without it being clean. Out comes the Mr. Proper. Out comes the Mr. Muscle. I understand. 
Yes, uh, actually, I like uh, my room. I want to be. I like a clean room. I clean things, so I don't like it dirty. But sometimes, if I don't have enough time, I have to go. So not a problem for me, but sometimes. See, so, so I, I think the problem is sometimes people like it bothers them too much. You know. It's just an unmade bed. It it will be unmade again when you go to sleep. That's what I say. Right. Vitaly, what do you think? You think ah, it's just an unmade bed? Who cares? You know, what is your attitude? You Does it me? bother you? Uh, what um, Vitaly. About, about me? I think that um, unmade bed is um, bad. It's uh, the bed is a personal place. It's like your underwear. You it's your have... domain. What? It's your domain. It's your domain, yes. You don't have to show it to each other. So, in my habit, I do my bed uh, every time as I get up. Uh, it's the first uh, thing that I usually do. You know where you usually see dirty beds? On contact. VK. You know, people always... <laughs> Doing something and showing, oh gee, look, I have a dirty bed here. You know, they don't, they don't make it. But you know what? Like for me, it doesn't bother me at all. Not at all. <laughs> uh, people who call but don't leave a message. Wait a minute. In Eastern Europe, you, you guys never leave a message. I hate when people don't leave a message. You understand what I mean? Why? You mean uh, when you can pick up a receiver and uh, you have no message after it? Yeah, you know, like a voicemail message. I want to mm. know who called. I want to know what they want. What they want? What do you want? Mm. Oh my God. But in Ukraine, it's not very popular, so I, I guess you so guys don't use this feature. In Russia, too. <laughs> yeah, I know. Okay, so I really... I mean, what, what happens when someone phones you and you don't answer? You just phone them back, right? Usually that's how it works. Because in North America, we usually leave a message. You know, we do. No, we use cell phones. That's why maybe it's. it's what? Not. What? 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 Now we use cell phones, mobile phones, and now it's not a problem to know who is. Who yeah, but we don't know what they want. <laughs> Just because they phone us. Mm. Uh, mm. Slow people in front of you. Mm. Uh, yes. One at a time here. You mean in the line? When you're standing in the line? When people are slow, like for instance, this one babushka in front of me, like she, she, was, <laughs> she was so slow, like I have to go. I, 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 I try to go left, I try to go right, I try to go up, I try to go down, I can't go anywhere, I'm stuck. Maybe you two wrap it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Tanya, does this bother you, slow people, or are you mm -hmm. slow too? Uh, oh, I don't know. Maybe and sometimes. I mean, I don't like when you are standing in the line in front of ATM machine or whatever, like, um, trying to get your money weekend. It always seems like the person in front of you is slower than you are, so it's a little bit... It depends. When you have a lot of time, you can just stand and, like, I don't care, but if you are in hurry, so... People don't have patience. Mm -hmm. yeah, People it's... don't have patience. Yeah, really. Hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> Any, anyone else with slow people in front of them? Like, with some people, if, 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 they, if I go left, they go left. If I go right, they go right. You know, what's the one? Are they doing it on purpose? <laughs> Vitaly? Uh, yes, um, I know the situation, but um, it's it's very uh, bother me when I I am in a bicycle and it's a really um, really bad situation when uh, I can uh, go to the road because there are a lot of uh, cars and uh, in front of me That's babushka suicide. or dedushka, <laughs> I just stay take my. Um, my bicycle in my arms and go to, uh, around with with, with babushka and uh, uh, ask her please uh, can you give me the road because I'm really <laughs> want to go there. 
They, they need a bicycle lane. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Luba, slow people, or do you do you walk slow too? No, they they don't um, bother me. I mean, slow people. I I'm very patient person. <laughs> I would say. In New York, if you're slow, you will be run over. <laughs> you 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 will die by being run over. Person got died by being run over by by sheep sheep herd in New York Manhattan state. So yeah, like in Toronto, just uh, you you gotta you gotta walk fast. They will run over you for sure. And sheep follow other sheep. So if other one person steps on you, the other another person will step on you. So that's why it's good to be fast. But you know what? Sometimes we can be lazy. Anyways, it's nine. 57, we only have a couple more minutes left. Any other annoyances before we wrap this up that really bothers them? Makes them angry. Makes them that they want to explode. Share now or forever hold your peace. Hmm. I don't like... Uh, can, I, can I talk? Yep. I don't like when uh, the water is um, dripping uh, from the tap. It's a rather annoying sound. <laughs> Drip. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it after a while it becomes a bigger sound and then a oh, bigger sound yes. and a bigger sound. <laughs> but usually we tighten the pipes for this, but sometimes we're too lazy to do this, so you know we just think it'll go away on its own. Any other annoyances? Anything else? Anything else? Going once, twice. Three times. I guess not. I don't know. Oh, wait, wait. People. We, got, we got a winner. Huh? Victoria. Uh, I don't like it. Yes. Um, I don't like when people interrupt or, or people don't listen. Mm, oh, it annoys me. And um, sometimes I want to say you talk about. Um, Slowly people. I want to say that here, mm -hmm. we see slowly people every day. And before I was so fast, <laughs> and now mm, I used to live to live like that. So they're so slowly. Don't uh, mm, I don't can't show that I don't like that. But I feel that I want. To, That I want faster, not so slow, slowly. Mm. And you know what? Like, yeah, people who like always talk about themselves, but all the time, you know, me, 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 me. Everyone likes to talk about themselves, but some people they, they act like they're president of the United States or something. So. <laughs> <sighs> all right. So, anyways, it's ten o'clock at night. Soon the moon will be up. I don't think there's a full moon or the Sabacus will be out there barking. Uh, it's been a great conversation hour. Sorry for the, the cat that's been uh, screaming its head off there. I have to do something about that. Are there any questions for me? You cannot see my rabbit. My rabbit is scared yes. today. You can't see the rabbit. That I'd will be like for next see. Thursday. That any does other questions? Sorry? What does the rabbit eat? What does he maybe My rabbit eats everything. <laughs> Whole up the veranic <laughs> everything. Okay. My rabbit eats tries to eat rabbit food too. So don't 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 ask. Don't do not ask these questions. Try to eat rabbit food. Okay. <laughs> well, I bought I bought cat food by mistake and it was rabbit it had rabbit, right? Whiskers. And my cat does not eat whiskers, it eats raw canin cat food. So I accidentally, uh, the rabbit got the whiskers food, and it had rabbit in there, and the rabbit was eating <laughs> eating rabbit food. So that's what I wanted to say there. So if there are any other questions, I'm going to wrap this up. It's now 10.01. For private bookings, you can always go through Lingo and look at my profile. You know, it's the summer days. Holidays are coming up, actually, pretty soon, actually. So you can always look at my schedule, and if my schedule doesn't work for you, you can always try to make it work for you, or ask me personally. Uh, you know, when when I have free time per se. 
So you can always look at my Amlingo uh, profile page for more information about me. Okay, so are there any other questions? No, going once, twice? No. Um, no. I yeah. have a question. Okay, yes, yes, quick, quick. Yeah, so this is just different. Um, like you as a foreigner, so you said like you have been in Ukraine, yes, or you're right now in Ukraine. Are you right now? I'm in Kiev, yes. I'm in Kiev, yeah. So, I mean, like, uh, what do you think about Ukraine in general? Like, is it okay for you some stuff, like, really an annoys you in Ukraine? I mean, like, my friend uh, is coming soon from the United States to Kiev, and I am kind of want to show him my country, and I'm kind of, like, thinking about foreigners. I don't know. It depends on the person. I mean, uh, my background is Ukrainian. I, I know a lot about Ukraine before, so I, I, I expected it to be a little bit different. But for, for some people, even for some foreigners, uh, you know, they're, they're not used to a different country because, like, in, in our in Western countries, uh, we have everything for us. We have a McDonald's. We have a KFC. We have people who clean for us, people who, who shower us, people who do everything. So we become very lazy in, in our society. So, you know, uh, some people who uh, they don't have all their accommodations, they're not going to like it, but that's just because they're very lazy. So that's the main complaints that I see that any foreigner who came to Ukraine is just that people didn't work for them, per se, right? So it's not for everyone, but I, I have no problem here because I'm not a lazy person. Yes, thank you so much. Not a problem. So everyone, panel three, all right, we'll see you next Thursday. Do Provencina. Good night. Bye, Bye.